Hey everyone, it's Dr. Hazel from The Food Medic and welcome back to my fourth recipe with Insta Brands for our healthy recipe series. And today we are making a pea and mushroom risotto using the Instant Pot Pro Crisp and the pressure cooker lid. So this recipe is really, really simple to make. You can make it in 10 minutes. It's also really delicious and something that you can make a huge amount of. So it'll last you for the week or if you're cooking for a family, it's perfect as well. First of all, you're gonna have some risotto rice. Make sure you're using that rice and not other rice. Some frozen peas, sliced mushrooms, one diced onion, some Parmesan cheese, butter, garlic, white wine, but you can leave that out and just use extra stock, and some parsley, which we're gonna add in at the end. Okay, so let's get started. Step one is we're going to saute our onion and our garlic in our butter. So I'm going to select the saute function. You can ignore the time. I'm happy with that temperature. And so I'm just gonna click start. <laughs> so my preheating is finished and I'm ready to saute. So I'm gonna add the butter into the pot and allow that to melt. Just make sure to keep stirring it so that you don't let it cook too much. So next I'm gonna take my rice and I'm gonna add that in. Next, adding our mushrooms, which I've sliced already, and your white wine if you're using it. Give that about a minute to cook, and then we're gonna add in our stock, and then we'll be ready to cook the rest of it. So I'm going to cancel my saute and add in my stock. So my stock's in now and I'm going to pop my lid on and pressure cook it for seven minutes. So I'm going to leave that to cook itself. That's the best thing about this pot is that you can put everything in there, cook everything in there and leave it to set. And if I was doing this normally on a hob, I'd have to keep stirring and it would take twice as long. So it's perfect if you're hosting for guests or you're just very busy like me. The cooking program is finished and I'm just gonna click the quick release to release the pressure. Okay, so the pin has dropped and I can open the lid. So just give it a good stir. Now we're gonna add in the rest of our ingredients. We've got our peas, just gonna stir them through, and our Parmesan cheese. Finally, some fresh parsley. So as you can see, it's really creamy. So it's perfect as it is, but I'm gonna add just a little bit of extra Parmesan on top and a pinch of black pepper. So there we have it, that's my pea and mushroom risotto made in the Instant Pot, ready in no time.